Hey guys, Dragon Ball Super shares a big Vegeta and Kaba moment. So look at the latest chapter of Dragon Ball Super Manga Saw near 6 KLA. Unleash the power of the legendary Super Saiyan all over the tournament of power and nearly wipe out the termites in the process in order to stop Kelly Berskis their page. Her followers Saiyan Kaba and Kolifla stepped in and that confrontation led to another great movement between Kaba and his mentor Jita. When Kaba first figure, uh, figures out the Kele is the legendary Super Saiyan, he explained the situation to Kolifla who flips out after hearing the Kele could literally wreck herself to death. Like a true leader, Kaba powers up to the Super Saiyan and jumps into the fray in trying to reason with Kele his good intentions are rewarded by the Kele nearly Kaba with an uppercut and sends him flying from ring. Kaba's fate would have been sealed right there if not for a timely save from Vegeta who grabs the young Saiyan and pulls him back just before the, he goes flying over the ringside. In true Vegeta fashion, the benevolent act does not come wrapped in friendly attitude. Vegeta entire take a take on the situation pretty much goes like this. What was that? Tossed aside by your own Ellie. How pitiful, how pitiful. What's going on with her? Explain. Once Kaba explained his LSSJ theory, Vegeta is none left all the pressed nodding that an extreme transformation that emphasized pure power. Those powerhouse moves might catch you off guard at first, but they are simply enough to read after the observing a bit. What's so very interesting and probably interesting with the fan base is that in canon storyline of the mango, uh, manga, Kabak knows more about the legendary Super Saiyan Vegeta does. This scene confirms that Vegeta is hearing about LSSJ for the first time as he clinically views it as in simply extreme transformation that emphasized pure power. That's pretty wild considering Vegeta was part of the non canon introduction of LSSJ 25 years ago when the first Dragon Ball Z Broly the legendary Super Saiyan movies was released. Big difference in Dragon Ball Super Manga and M anime top arcs have now made Kelly the LSSJ frontrunner in Dragon Ball Canon, which is about to get really interesting when the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie arrives at the end of the year. That film will finally make Broly part of the official canon. Will the film make reference to Kelly LSSJ? Reveal the details may be. Different, but Kelly differently went LSSJ in both the enemies in manga, meaning that Goku and Ujita will have seen an example of the form before they have their fateful meaning meeting with Broly. Dragon Ball Heroes is the new promotion anime series now streaming online in Japan. My Hero Academia will always its worst on August 3rd. Dragon Ball Super the movie will be released in December. Both these air their English dubs. Saturday nights on Cartoon Network's Toonami. Thanks guys for watching. If you want to watch more exciting videos, so subscribe, like, and share if you have any questions so you can ask from me. Thanks guys.